Howdy, fellas. Welcome back to Goat Rodeo Gaming. Today, playing Run 8 Train Simulator again, Episode 2. If you didn't watch the first one, I plan on doing a pickup, packing some helpers on. And then we got old Golden Wonder with us today. He's playing Railroads Online. So we're just going to hang out, BS. And you'll probably see us both playing different games on the same screen. So let us know what you feel about that. And, uh, yeah, that's it. So let's get going. Let's get going, brothers. Brother. Cool. I'm going to be doing track laying today, guys. Uh, so it's going to be kind of boring on my end. So whatever. <laughs> I need to find okay, this gonna... camera button. Camera ground. Camera tracking D4. Let's see how that works. Oh, that ain't do I... nothing. I don't like the zoom. Don't know how to fix it. Just start clicking buttons. Yeah. That works. Oh, okay. Clickety click. Clickety clack. All right, let's get focused so I don't put shit on the ground. <laughs> Clickety clack. That's whack jack. Oh! Oh my heavens. 5.30 in the morning and I'm on already. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> yeah, we get up early, fellas. <laughs> yeah, my job. I have to get up super early. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, I'm usually at work by now. That's funny. Today's my day off, so. Yeah. I work from home. Hi. All right, let's see if we can have a good meet. It's going to be hard to run all these trains as a dispatcher while I'm trying to train myself. <laughs> train. Train. Um, <laughs> first thing we got to do is we got to line ourselves out of the yard. Okay, let's make sure we have some room. He's crossing over. Okay, so let me give myself a signal right here. You know what? I put these tracks over that track you can't delete over yeah. by the freight yard. I'm wondering if you run an engine over it, will it kick it and like shoot it up in the air like sometimes it happens? Try it out, it. Yeah. Oh, boy. <laughs> boy. Oh boy. All right, let's start these bad boys. Clyde at five. Yes, I'm learning, guys. I'm learning. But can you retain that memory? Most likely not. Yeah. All right. So what do we got to do here? I gotta think. Uh oh. I gotta. I gotta use my braid. So we're going to add these tank cars, we're doing a pickup to rot hers. Give us enough room. Okay, well let's see what that looks like. Buy these. Dude, that's a little wonky Buy. right there. Buy. Buy. We'll do another one. We're going to leave them in emergency though, so no big deal. Wonky donkey. We're going to close. Open the coupler. Yep, that's what I thought. We're stretched out. Let me go to the head end. Let's see what this looks like. Ooh, 
That's butter. Butter. He was butter. a real brother. All right, this is gonna be weird to do. Weird. It's gonna be kind of weird. Let's see if I can roll weird. back into it. I hate when the switch goes backwards when you attach it. What's up with that? Yeah. <sighs> it kind of does mess this up. Can we do it now? Too you much know stretch for us, bro. I just roll back into it. There it goes. Oh, that's like shooting off into the sky. Come on, bro. I'm jumping. How about this one? Someone tell me to get rid of this red cross. I don't like it. Dude, you know what we gotta do? Is we gotta have an engine that we call it the General and have it 01 like the Dukes of Hazards. <laughs> Fuck yeah, dude. Hell yeah. Dude. You know what? It uh, We'll do that with the o, uh, 440 because there was a 440 called the General. Oh, yeah. And it was, okay, for all you historians out there, a, okay, it was in the south. Now, I'm going off of memory here, so if I screw things up, I screw it up. But there was like a little commando team from the north that snuck into the south, stole that engine, and was going down the line sabotaging shit before they got caught. And they ran. And I think the name of that engine, it was a 440, and I think it was called the General. If I screw that up, put some comments in there. I'm, I'm pretty sure uh, that happened. Uh, Nutty. Nutty. What I need to do is... Uh, Come on, dude. I need to know what... I bet you this has a 1% grade right here. I wish you could like look okay devs if you're listening could we get a button so you hit like K or whatever you're looking at the foundation and you get a K and it tells you like uh, it's it's gradient would be nice because uh, I try to do less grades as possible, and I, this is screwing up my switch. Um, let's do this, then. This set out, it's going really well. Just kidding, it's not. <laughs> what the? This is what we're gonna do. I'm gonna click on this coupler. We're gonna get in the cab. I'm just gonna freaking shove back into it real hard. And then we'll see if she'll go. Thought I'd try it, but I guess it not. Let's get in the seat. Oh, yeah, there's a definite look at that. Yeah, there's a big old gap. Okay, let's go up. Yay, we did it, guys. Ha <laughs> Take longer than I thought. <laughs> Alright, got that closed. Okay, so now we're gonna 
pull ahead onto the main. Go back and get these cars. This is my first time switching cars. So, I'm gonna suck. Just throw that out there. Hit up the switch. Actually, I think I'll get in the cab and just make sure I do everything right. Because I still don't got these controls down very well. Whoopsie da do. Okay, so I want to do this. All right, that's good. Old school. What do they call these things? Like beacons or something. I got one on top of the unit I'm using. Those lights are used to flash, but they don't have them anymore. Oh, wow. Like a, the, the little like hazard flashers? Yeah, on top of the roof of the cab. Yeah. I forget what those are called. So the railroad stopped using those, huh? Uh, on the remote control locomotives, they still have them. Oh, I can see that, yeah. So that you know it's in remote control. Yeah. Yeah, we just call them beacons, beacons in the trucking world. Yeah, I think or, that's what they Or, called. yeah. The uh, wide load guys use them. Um, when I did wide loads with my grain truck, I had those going. Uh, now let's see if my switch will work good. Why are these not working? Oh, that might be why. <laughs> <laughs> Daddy like. Ooh, that's... Flashlight. Flashlight. That's cool. Are you gonna knuckle? <laughs> so this is going so rough. <laughs> <laughs> that's a that's a video to watch. You guys go to YouTube and look up Parliament, a song called Flashlight. It's insane. They have like 20 people up on the stage. They had like a UFO. It was crazy. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Okay, so I so I have a little hump going over those permanent tracks. And I had my tr I laid some freestyle track over it. I attached the switch. But the switch went with the tracks and didn't lay down on the road bed because the road bed has a one minus one percent uh. so like the the switch is hovering it looks kind of cool all right what's we going don't, on in here we don't play those games here oh uh, put the reverser in neutral what the hell you got it i got it yeah god <laughs> <laughs> 
You're she good. Should, you're good. <laughs> you got it. You're good. I'm not good. Put that right there. Oh, wrong way. <laughs> got a signal right there. That was my problem, that little tip. This is rough, but this is my first time, so. There we go. That's butter. I'm like, what's her face cooking with butter here? Butter. Oh, this is sweet. So this is going to be the inbound outbound track I'm building right here. Nice. Where you pull from the yard. And this is all, all that switching is going to be done without screwing up the main. So you could switch as I blast by. Oh, sweet. Or whatever. You know. I'm going to throw some uh, firewood in old Betsy. Oh, Betsy. Hey, guys, fans Spencer. of both of these games, let us know. We are... slack is pretty legit here's a little trick little tip for everyone here with Betsy with other boilers you don't need to open up the bottom hatch you can aim at the top of the boiler and just shoot it in and here's the thing devs if you're listening please don't change that opening up that thing is a pain in the ass one day here I want to go full realistic where you're I'm not hitting the F button and I'm actually working the button you know pulling the stuff and then I'll do that but until then let us have that please please Jenny Jenny please do you have a clip of him saying Jenny I could probably get one yeah you gotta you gotta bust that Jenny out <laughs> bust the Jenny out <laughs> <laughs> oh you gotta get Peter laughing too Oh, yeah. All of it. <laughs> Alright, guys. So, we're going to need helpers to get over the hill since we're adding these cars on. Problem is, is our rear car is a hazmat car. And you can't put helpers up against a hazmat car. So, I'm going to put a box car onto the helper power. And then we'll have a buffer car to come out with, with the helpers. Dude, that looks kind of ugly. Ooh. I feel like that's I'm working on my job again. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. Except it's a little easier with the box, because it's like toggles. and It's like doing an RC car, it's just a big box. That's cool. And I actually work with somebody else, that's just by myself, like I'm here. I think that'd be weird working with a remote. I mean, it takes some getting used to. Doesn't feel natural. I bet. Because you gotta think as a conductor, as a switchman, and as an engineer all at once. so they don't have to pay more employees imagine that uh-huh and you could do it much quicker with an engineer and a conductor and a switchman so yeah it's not like it's more efficient let's just keep that in mind fellas it's no better so I'm taking it slow because uh, I'm new to this game Ooh, that yeah, looks that smooth. looks ugly. That looks ugly. Through here. Mm 
Damn. Okay, so now we're butter. Go forward. <laughs> That's butter, brother. It's it's butter, brother. <laughs> yeah. Might have to redo this section, but I'm all right. Seems to get switched. I see we got the emergency sound. Holy back roll. Harry Murray. Oh, here's a question I had for you um, with real trains. Okay, now, when you have, see in trucking, when you have tankers, um, there's the motion of the liquid inside when you're stopping or going, and it's called surge. Yeah. And it goes back and forth, kind of like with the coupler slack when you know when you stop. Yeah. Now, do you when you have a bunch of those tank cars, how bad is the surge? Like, can you really feel that? Um. Yes. Uh, I I could imagine if you had like a ethanol train or an oil train, it'd probably be pretty severe. I mean, I never had any of those, but yeah, there mm. is a surge. I remember just switching cars. Um, being in the yard, oh, I came up short. <laughs> yeah, being in the being in the yard, just switching cars, man. Like I would visibly watch them shake back and forth because of the liquid in there. Oh wow! Now see, in the semi tankers, we have the baffles, which is like the walls inside, uh -huh. with holes to like slow it down. Do you guys have that in those tank cars, or are they just pure open, do you know? I think they do have something like that to help the slush. But to be honest, I don't know for sure. Mm. It wasn't one of those things where... I don't know, I guess they, knowing it or not knowing it, it wasn't like something that was cared about. You know, probably in the car department, uh, they knew about that. But... Um, yeah, definitely a lot of slush. Yeah. See, when I went through truck driving school to get my license way back in the day. Back in my um, day. Back in my day, Debbie Dutson was there. Um, little reference for people in California. Um, so it, they taught you about the surge and how to deal with it and all that. Did they didn't teach you that in when you were going through your training not that i remember um wow yeah but that's a good hook okay crazy we're not gonna yep. stretch it because i don't care every time you come to a hook guys you're supposed to do a stretch to make sure it's a good couple well guess what i don't care because it's a game yeah, we do, uh, in trucking, we do what we call a tug test. And you leave the trailer brakes on once you coupled and you got all your lines on and you leave your landing gear down and you do a little tug test. Ah. And then you bring your landing gear up and then you take off. Nice. Yeah. The good drivers do that. The lazy ones don't. And then next thing you know, they're dropping shit in the yard. Yeah. Or a truck stop. Okay, I don't know why I ran over there. Whatever. Okay, that needs to poop there. So this is going to be the main line right here that runs around the whole yard there. Uh. And then these are, like I said, the inbound, outbound. Um, so I need to complete this loop to turn the train around so it's complete. So many trees. I wish you could ride cars in this game. Like there's a control where you walk up, oh. like you walk up to the a ladder on these cars and you push like F something and you start riding. Cause that would that would make this a lot easier to control, in my opinion. And you have a much better perspective. But hey, whatever. That's super cool. What are you gonna do, brother? What are you gonna do, brother? Brother. Yeah, 
how funny towards the end of his life he looked like a Slim Jim. Poor guy. <laughs> That's an observation. All that tanning booth. Yeah, just an observation. Don't mean to be mean. Poor guy. This damage. I was watching a Hulk Hogan video and he was talking about was it Hulk Hogan? And he was talking about how Randy Savage talked like that in real life too. Oh wow. Yeah, like that wasn't like that was his normal self, the way he talked like that. There was more acting, like he, he did a little bit more over the top, but his voice was like that and he talked like that. Wow. So I kind of feel bad for the guy because that man, that your vocal cords being strained like that, that's not cool. No, you know? no, I don't screw you up. Lumberjack in. Oh yeah, blind switching moves. I love it. <laughs> okay. I really need to get this done first before I finish that. do with gents actually I think this is a cool idea because you're actually doing stuff with action while I'm just laying track so if somebody wants to watch like you could keep an eyeball on mine to see if you can get pick up any good tips yeah or and and they mainly watch yours which is all the action I like that idea that's kind of cool yeah you know I thought of it and I was like hey you know people might like that since we can't play together Oh. Come on. Come on. I thought I had it perfect, but I guess not. Oh, I gotta blow my nose. This will give me a chance. One sec, fellas. One sec. Stand by. Blow it. Blow it, brother. Blow it all out, brother. Well, if you're watching me and with all the logging, you might get dizzy here. So, uh, sorry, guys. Daddy's so back. Much. Oh, God. No. Oh, no. We need to run. Oh, no, we don't. Okay. I answered my own question. I answered my own question. Nice. We're just going to play with the uh, independent. I got a set honor. Do we? We'll see what she does. In this situation, okay, so you'd have to switch with a set on this thing, no doubt. Now, I could go down there to the joint and watch it come in, but then I don't have a good perspective of how fast this is going. So, I'd rather do the dismay. Dude, switching cars could be a ma major 
had to buy yourself on this game too, like railroads online. Oh yeah, because there's so much. Well, the the problem when you're switching on with railroads online is when you're when you get going, you get all these cars and you can't see. You gotta do little pro tips like shadows and stuff to try to yeah. figure things out. Hundred percent. Pro tips, bruh. Here's another pro tip I, I want to show everybody here. I used to try to jump up on the train, but a lot of times I would overshoot the other side. All you got to, you can just walk up on these things without jumping. You don't need to jump. And that's my golden pro tip of the day. That and the boiler. Because I'm Golden Wanderer, get it? Yeah. Golden tip of the day, I love it. That's going to be a new thing. Yeah. You did it. Too cool for school. Yeah. Without my flashlight. I got a flashlight, Martin. Flashlight. Neon lights. Be back here. I'm two tracks over now. If I go over here, you can tell even less how fast it's going. So that's why, since it's a game, a lot of times I'd have to be at the joint. But since it's a game, I like to see how fast that thing's going. That's a problem. Oh, yeah, we're going to have a slammer. <laughs> slammer. Independent. Oh. Woohoo! I actually got it down. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about with the whole being able to ride cars. Maybe you can, I don't know, but that would be really nice. Be able to take shoves and see what's going on, then you can adjust like I would on the remote controls when I had to ride cars. I could just a little too fast. I just hold on with one hand and use the box with the other hand. Because, you know, safety first. All right. Bring her in. Dude, where do you see this? Okay, because I have two switch stands next to each other. And you know how I do that little, like, road bed with the blocks for the switch stands? This is going to look cool. That's kind of, ooh, that switch is kind of off, though. He will Daddy be fun like. with the with the dual footage is that I can actually watch this video for fun because I don't know what you're doing. Yeah. And vice versa. Do I want to do this? Maybe I do a left here. I don't know. Come on. I'm releasing the brakes. Let's go. Let's see what happens if I put a left in. I don't want to put a left. Yeah, my cool thing, I might have to abandon. Ooh, I don't like that at all. I can do this. I'm gonna see if I can still do that little trick. Let's do this. There we go. That, <clears throat> that worked out pretty good. Ah, uh, put in emergency. Ha ha! Do that. Well, that's cool. That's realistic. Okay. Can't be mad at that. Now that I remember. That's better. Thing's only partly open. Yeah, it should do it twice. It's already an emergency. Ha ha ha. All right, let's see what we got going on here. Let's do this for giggles. This is hilarious. <laughs> the way do you see that? Oh, I hope I could. I hope this lines up. Oh, I think I can make this line up and look butter. But basically, the switch stands are butt to butt, and it looks funny. This is going to be confusing. I love it. 
I think I want to keep that in. Because you're going to be like, what the hell? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is going to be great. Oh. I, I feel like... Uh, okay, you know the scene in, in Jurassic Park, the first one, where, where Ned's at the cafe, and the guy comes and he shows him that the little canister of shaving cream and he opens it up and he's like, yeah, it still works. And, and Ned's like laughing. Yeah, that's me right now. <laughs> you might have to do that clip. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he does that really high pitched squeal laugh too. That dude lost a lot of weight in real life. Oh yeah? Yeah, he was real heavy in Jurassic Park. He lost a lot of weight. All right, what do we got going on with these trains? Where you at, bud? Oh, this is butter. It'll put... Oh, no, it's not. That's ugly. What? What? All right, so we're going to have to get this thing going, and then we'll pull out the helpers, and blah, 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 blah. Where's the cap lights in this thing? Dookie. Dookie. You're being dookie, brother. I want to know if people who are watching on YouTube start saying brother a lot. That'd be so funny. What do you do? <laughs> like some guys are making fun of us you know they're making fun of us and then next thing you know like they're saying brother all the time that would be hilarious we gotta start a movement <laughs> yeah the brother movement brother brother okay why is this not connecting the way it doesn't look good it looks too boxy Right there. That's my problem right there. Okay. So I make sure I get all of this before I take off. That'd be kind of crappy. Oh, there we go. That's butter. Look at that, boys. Butter. But, uh, okay, so what I need to do is start the grade right here down to the ground. So I basically put my, I have a four track yard here down at the freight house, nice little yard, nothing big. And I put it on the ground so that way you can kick cars down there without worrying about it. Oh, nice. Yeah. Why didn't you? Nope. Do this. Bam. All right, so we got it all. That's good. Get rid of that. Get rid of this. Bam. And then we start the grade right there and go down. That I like. Oh, this, this is, this is a mind blow over here with this one. <laughs> oh, this is great. Trades oh, it hill. didn't. Let's try it from this end. Okay, which way does the switch go? Run for there we go, baby. That's butter. <laughs> butter. <laughs> I can't wait to, to hear your reaction on, <laughs> on that thing. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this is going to be great. You like doing a morning run today, boys.
Just so you know, Mojave Yard is on a 1% grade. Might actually even be steeper than that. I had Perfect. A, I knew a manager in Yermo that would cover for Yermo sometimes, but he was the manager of Mojave. And, well, they would pull a coal train in here to take the Trona. They'd have to tie it down and have to tie every single brake on the coal train. <gasps> oh my god, you're kidding me. No. Wouldn't that be awesome? How many cars was it? Do you know? That was about a mile long. <gasps> so. Oh my god. Insane. Insane on the membrane. Run five, brothers. I'm gonna stop the rear right around here. The rear. Yeah. Okay, we need to get rid of these. That's gonna screw up on the grade. Okay, so if you have patience and you learn the controls, doing this stuff by yourself isn't the end of the world, but it is a little tricky. So how much is that game? 50 bucks. Ooh, yeah, I need to, uh, I can't get that right away. Yeah. Don't go wonder poor. <laughs> I'm happy, but I'm poor. You know, that's the switch. I love my life, but it's poor. Yeah. Yeah, I don't have to stress out and chase money. It's worth every penny. I gotta tell you that, that's for sure. That's cool. I think Railroads is worth every penny, too. I really do. Yeah. I really love this game. I really do. Yeah, it's a good game, for sure. Fantastic job, devs. Fantastic job. I can't believe Craig hasn't got this game yet. Craig, yeah. cheeky nuggy. Cheeky nuggy. Cheeky nuggy. Guys, comment if you want Craig to join the crew. He's got the best voice impersonations. In. Oh, yeah. He could do Braveheart. Like, ah. Uh. He, he is, imitation-wise, he is really good. I, 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 talk, I was with him. He's got a little end scale. He's, he's starting out on end scale. And uh, I was at his house. Uh, shnikes, that was uh, Saturday? No, that was uh, last Thursday. That was Thursday. And uh, he, it, I, I'm just trying to work him, but it, it's weird. He's, it's a weird thing. Yeah, he, he's nasty. hard to convince sometimes. Yeah. We love you, Craig, but trust us when we yeah, tell you you should get a video game. <laughs> you got the blinders on, buddy. But, um, that's Craigy Chicky Nuggy. He loves uh, chicken nuggets, so that's why we call him Chicken Nuggy. Yeah, that's his staple meal is chicken nuggets and fries. Poor guy. That's the only meat he eats is, is chicken. Really? Yeah, and most of the time it's fried chicken. Wow. Poor guy. He used now, to move to the south. <laughs> lately, I think he's been trying to eat better, but he's not doing like vegetables and fruits. Like yeah. his vegetable is french fries. <laughs> I think I fucked that up. I mean, it is potatoes. Nope, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> his insides I feel bad for him I know he won't watch this video so <laughs> oh if you do Craig we love you we just care about you yeah he really needs to get old fast too oh, yeah oh my god dude. with his imitations on hold fast that's legendary status there yeah Legendary. So we're doing. So you know, oh, go for oh. it. 
I was gonna do a pro tip right here. So when you're deleting these these 90 degree crossings, if you well, you can't see it, Dakota, but if you go into these corners, it'll delete right away. Right there. Um, yeah, you have to be watching me to see it. So. I can't see it, brother. Like your boy Ray Charles. Oh. I listened to that America song the other day. I love that song. When Ray Charles does America. Yeah. Such a great song. And he's like so passionate in, while he's doing that song. It, it, it's That's the best version of that song. Is his version. The best. Oh, Ray Ray. Plus, he's great if you guys ever watch um, the Blues Brothers. He's in that, too. Oh, yeah. I remember that movie. Yeah. Dude, the car chase through the mall. Awesome. Let's see here. Control F. Leather. Alright, so I need to relinquish. Oh, look at that. A road crossing that we didn't blow for. Yee -wee. Oh, God. I'm telling. I'm telling. I'm telling. Alright, what's fly what mode again? What fly the mode? hell? Nope, I just good. did the gap in the rails again. Oh, that's a problem. I might watch the video and see how that popped here's another dev moment how did I that was weird well, I'm gonna have to oh. watch this and see what happened I did it super quick so I wasn't paying attention I don't know why I got a knuckle right there that's interesting I was wondering why oh, the train went to emergency, train but that that's really weird. Weird. It's so weird. It's so weird. Yeah, look at that. Dude, I love these switch stands. Oh my god, this is awesome. You were gonna laugh your ass off on this one. I'm prepared. Oh, I could do the same thing to this one. stuff happening here. Weird. Weird. Era. It's all weird. Mayor Quimby. Quimby. The Simpsons there. Oh. Era. Alright, let's see here. I still own... Ah, oh, that sucks. Relinquish this train over here. Hell yeah. Back to back. Ah. These switches are tag teaming each other, brother. Tag team it, brother. Tag team switch in action. Brother. Brother. So what I need to do is. Get this train back together, I guess. Oh, hey, that helps. How the hell do I do that? This whole thing is still my train. How do I relinquish all at once? That's ugly. Yeah, I started it too early. Yeah, look at that. Dang it. This was a major mistake.
Butter. <laughs> I can't stop laughing at these switch stands, dude. Oh my god. <laughs> There's two in a row. Oh, this is funny. I, uh... Yeah, buddy. Hanging uh, and banging. Hanging and banging, brother. Oh, okay. How do I, uh, relinquish everything? Just do that. Brother. 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 Brother, brother. I... Okay, so if you guys haven't been paying attention, how I get the roadbed to go back into the switches is I bring this little piece off so I know it's the same level, and then I lay it down again and just go back up underneath the switch. So I've been doing this already in the video, but I just wanted to say it out loud for everybody here. And that's how you get like a perfect ground underneath the switch right there. Perfect. So there you go. Brother. Okay, so now we'll just start, start our descent. Uh... What's going on exactly? I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Curvy. Boop. Down like that. This sucks. How do I work my way around this? I'm good. I'm good. What, what's going on on your side? Um, you can control multiple trains, but you have to relinquish your control over the train. So what happened was is I got a knuckle on the head and not really sure why. I was stretched out going uphill. So what I was going to do is I relinquished now that we're in two trains I relinquished my control over the power and I was going to run down get on the helpers and shove it up against it. But now I only have control over the train and I can't relinquish everything on the train. So it's like really annoying. Did you say pretty please? Pretty please. No, it doesn't work. No, it doesn't. No. I don't know if I like that. I don't like that. We have to go through and click relinquish on every rail car. <laughs> oh God, you're kidding me. Yep. Time to go for a walk, boys. Uh, well, I guess people will be watching my side then. Uh -huh. Yeah, buddy. The only way I can think to do it, there might be a control somewhere, but I don't know it. I don't know. I guess this is what you get for trying to do a pickup and add helpers and all this crap, like the second time you've played the game. <laughs> yeah, the second time you play the game, you're trying to do all this stuff. That's hilarious. Yeah. Go oh, big like or go home, brother. Go big or go home. Like a cage match. My plan was to try to get to Bakersfield by the end of this video. <laughs> Yeah, good luck with that. It's going to be a four-hour video. Yeah, it'll never upload. Yeah. That'll work. Ah. 
So we go back to the head end and do the do. I know there's a flying mode, but like I said, I'm new. Just trying to keep it simple as possible. I screwing that up yes I am yeah I need to cut start the turn in early right there let's get rid of that one too I'll let this one go mock speed whoa 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 oh there we go we got it now, boys. Oh, here's our Santa Fe train finally rolling through. <laughs> wow, that horn sounds really good on that train. the grade that's kind of crazy looking right there so if you haven't seen our other videos I have my the uh, foliage turn down low so it's easier to lay track guys so if some of you are wondering like what the heck happened to is this graphics suck or something no it's just easier to lay foundations and track without all the foliage in the way yeah a lot easier that's still a little I just got ran over by the other train. I'm dead. <laughs> Do you die in that game, or no. you just get pushed off to the side or something? Yeah. Oh, hey, you can like walk into trains. Oh. They're not like solid objects. Oh, okay. If that makes sense. Yeah. Oh man. A dispatcher would be chewing my ass in real life. What the hell are you doing? <laughs> my conductor's inept. Sorry. Uh, once again, we'll reference Ray Charles there, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Ray Charles <coughs> working on the railroad. No, he would do a better job because he would know better and he'd hear it. Yeah. Yeah, you would know better. My boy. Boy, Ray Ray. Shred that piano, dude. Coming back to a hook, okay? I can't believe I got a knuckle. That pissed me off. That looks like crap. Oh, we slammed that a little too much. Oh man, those dynamics on that duper sound so real. Duper. On the duper, brother. Super duper. Super duper. I think this looks like crap too. Yeah, it's like funky right in there. What's what's going on? Okay. Yeah, both of these kind of look like shit here. Alright. 
I'm gonna let you eventually when you can get into this game I want to see if you can clean that up a little I mean it it's decent it just looks funny because it's going down the grade yeah so I'm gonna see if you can clean that up I People probably watching my side like this guy is anal about his track land. Yeah. But hey guys, in this game, the smoother the track, the easier the operation. Yep. That's all there is to it. All right. I think I think we might almost be ready. No. Don't move, stay here. Gonna run through the train. Running through the train. Okay, all I gotta do is connect these up and the yard is done. Try's done. Running through the train. Running through the train. Buy some old hit country song somewhere. <laughs> so in reality, this should have taken maybe 45 minutes in real life. But we're not in reality at the moment. Wow. We're in 45 the... 45 minutes. Yeah. Take a look at our dispatching board just to make sure we're not uh, seriously messing anything up. I'll do the siding. Actually. I went too far. Stop. Bam. Yard is done. Suck on that. Alright, now what about these fellas over here? That should be good. Okay, so I'm going to stay. Dude, these inbound outbounds are going to be really. Inbound outbound, brother. Rolling units, please. Please, sorry. Making sure I got all that stuff in orders. Whoa. Hey, you can't ride a car if you're under control of it. That's funny.
mean we own the box car, but nothing else. I want to put her right there. Oh, this is fun. You got it all sorted? <laughs> uh, I think so. I think it's more bot than I thought. No big deal. Oh, I already got a switch for the sidings. Derp, derp, derp. Derp, derp. Derp, derp. Derping with the derps. That guy. Oh no, or is that the switch for that? Oh, I'm an idiot. I'm looking out the window. Time for a good old Alex Jones. I'm kind of retarded. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> ah! Yeah. Ah! I love it when he was wearing the tinfoil hat. I think that is the funniest thing ever. Yeah. Her boy. Yeah. The Jones. Um, Some awesome compilations out there of him, man. Yeah. I love the ones. I love the, the the videos where they put it to music. Him talking and yelling and stuff. I mean, those creators. That's just gold. Yeah. That is just gold. Hats off to you if you make those videos. Hats off to you. All so, trees must go. <laughs> so if you guys want to know the name Goat Rodeo Gaming, I'm demonstrating it right now. <laughs> Turns into a Goat Rodeo most of the time. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but we have fun with it. Meh. <laughs> Cause we're no better than a goat rodeo. Good heavens, this is taking way too long. My boy Clint Eastwood would be looking at me with that stupid grin on his face. <laughs> Hey, we're on board. Relinquish. Now to the head end we go. See if we can do this. Ah, oh, what a pain in the butt. But it was my idea.
So, I did some research on this game, and apparently you can... So, you tag cars to certain industries, right? And they unload and load when you go to those industries. So, you basically just attach them to the industry and the system. So, they know which cars go to certain industries. And you can actually use the hump in, like, Barstow or whatever to, like, separate your cars and, like, do everything that we talk about. It's freaking crazy. All right, well, before we get going, gents, I'm going to go take a pee. But I think we're ready to go finally. <laughs> wow, that's awesome. I'll be right back. <laughs> that's awesome. Righty on the left. Let's see what that gets us. Okay, so that main will be in there. That's ugly. Oh, there was that, oh, I might be able to do, oh, I deleted too much. Dang it. Dang it, Bubba. I'll tell you what. All right, let's try to get this thing over the hill. <laughs> oh, you're gonna have to get a Hank Hill going. Damn it, Bubba! <laughs> damn it, damn it, Bubba! Yeah. Is that moment of truth? I want the bell. I want the sander. Doggy. Okay, so that goes to inbound, outbound. This is mainline switching over. I 
zero and zero. Let me check something real quick. Is that a grade going up? Oh no, that's level. Stop putting a set on. <laughs> this might not work for my evil plan. Maybe. big boo-boo. I've had an engineer do that to me once. Actually, a few engineers start rolling back down the hill. It's always fun. <laughs> oh, God. That's a disaster right here. Why aren't you moving, SP-81 and 52? Sheesh! Why is this on an... I wonder if that goes up a grade right here. I wonder if that starts a grade. Hmm. Make sure the rear is loading. Zoom! Fly away! Fly away! Just kidding. We're on the ground. You drop cars on the ground? No. No. Oh. I only got one knuckle. That was my first knuckle. Now it's kind of a weird situation. I was already stretched out and it did it on me, so I don't know. Oh, almost. So I see the angle here. Okay. Alright, so those things are loading. That's what we wanted to check. DP load test. Brother. Brother. There's a way to change the horn on the locomotive, I guess. Someone told me, so I'm going to try to do that because the horn sound on this lead unit's just terrible. Sounds like I'm on a fishing boat or something. <laughs> like a foghorn. Yeah, burp. Like, um, no? Well, you know what I could have done is just this. Duh! Inexperienced. Inexperienced. That's what this is. Not knowing the game mechanics, that's all. Yeah. Let's see. Uh, did I not write it down? Damn it. They look through the comments on YouTube. You guys have been awesome. Dropping some knowledge. Hey, Brian, Dun, 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 dun. Control plus F3 to change the horns. Yes! Horn. Almost. Ay, ay, ay. Hey, devs, is it. I, here's, here's a wish right here. We could link these two ends, the, the top ends of the switches. Could do that little link with the other ends. That would be super. That's the wish list. That's that's one on the wish list there. Yeah. 
<laughs> they put a Ford car horn that you can set as the train horn. <laughs> what? That one's my favorite. That sounds like the old, like, Tawn Rail sounding sheet. Here we go. Let's try not to break this thing. <laughs> Everything's possible. Everything's possible. What, why is there, is there a height difference here? Am I just losing it? Yeah, there is. What the heck? Train stats. How do we track the train stats? Let me get this thing rolling. Run two or not? Damn it. Let's catch a little bit. Nope. That's the butter move I need. Squeeeeet. Understanding the 47 Barnett release track time story number 7786 on the site. Between TV code at the Elaine Lee 813 AM. This thing does not want to get going. That was uh, some unrealistic physics. No. Yeah. Uh, uh, <laughs> there goes my train. <laughs> uh, Is it like rolling down the hill or something? Yeah. It's totally rolling down the hill. <laughs> Bye! <laughs> Run away, train! <laughs> I got it. <laughs> Go chase after it, I guess. <laughs> rolling, rolling, rolling. Keep them doggies rolling. Wow. That's awesome. That's too funny. What about if I do this? I guess that's the way to do it. Maybe I should have put the helpers in the middle somewhere, jeez. Brakes do hook up pretty good. Oh wow, so even the brakes get hot and all that going, ooh, that's awesome. Oh yeah, because you were telling me about the trip in the sensor, so. Yeah, you can't get defects, which is pretty cool. That's crazy. Should I have this thing turn right away, maybe? Definitely a learning process. Let's see if I can get this to turn right. Away. Okay. 
Two knuckles. Uh huh. Don't think Gonna me. send it down the hill. Yeah. I think we just might not have enough power, and it, it's not placed in the right spot. I think there might be too much on the head end. Oh. Uh, not enough on the rear. Ah, it's this knuckle that broke. Okay, first of all, this would be the knuckle that would break. Those locomotive couplers are very high strength. Very, very high strength couplers. See, so who cares? All right, round three. <laughs> <laughs> See if the hill monster gets you again. <laughs> the hill monster. <laughs> oh yeah, that sounds obnoxious. I like that horn. Snow we got last night. Oh yeah, what what's your temperature up there? Uh, it's like thirty right now. Oh wow. Outside. I was telling him how cold it was outside. Turn on the heater, it's a little nippy outside. Okay, let's uh let's try this again, huh? I got a kid in the house, so if it sounds like I'm talking to nobody, it's because I'm talking to the kid. So heads up. not break this thing in half again. Just have to look for it. Alright, here we go. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen.
Ah. I screwed that up. That's weird. That's weird. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta watch the comments on this video to see if people are like, "Oh my God, you're not laying track like that," because I'm so anal. Wait, me messing up and you doing that? Three forty. That's three four zero to Wilson. Four point three one seven seven. Signing no switch. We're gonna have to go to run three to get this going. No, I'm screwing that up. Okay, wait a minute. Yeah, that looks ugly. Okay. That might have been too close. That was a weird, weird glitchy thing. Let's see how we're looking coming out of this switch. Yeah, it's still weird. It like shoots to the left and then turns in. Oh my god, this is taking forever. This is nasty. All right, I got her moving, and we're done too. Yay! That's gonna look like shite. I was at X Y with Future X at X Ray Sam Mapos. Yeah, look at the pictures right there. Not on my watch. Yeah, that that's that's another area I'm gonna have you fix. <laughs> I mean, it's fine for now. It's just not up to my well. That I'm gonna see if you notice it actually is what I should do. Supers are working. Wow, we just slid back pretty far. Huh? Where's the Gotta slide it. Gotta slide down the chrome pass, you know. Oh you got it. You're good. Yeah. True story. 
Yeah. Oh, hey, we're blocking a police officer. Sweet. <laughs> Highway Patrol, sorry. The smoky bears. Now, on that grade, in a big rig loaded going up, I do about 25 to 30 miles per hour towards the top. About 35 at the, kind of the bottom, starting up. Um, Pretty good. Yeah, so I, I'm kind of curious. Did, can you see the speed on your train? See what you're doing? I'm going up Mojave right now, up to oh. the speed, but typically we're about 15 on the train in real life. Oh, wow. Okay, that is for those, so I need to put another here. Wasn't exactly straight, but whatever. Let's do let's clean up this base. Oh. Oh. There we go. Should have done a three unit helper. Oh, it's just. <coughs> oh, well. Damn. You only got two. Probably going to be stuck in the run six until we get over this little hump right here and flatten out. If I throttle up again, I'll probably break this thing in half. Dennis does a lot of four wheeling up there. Yeah, the that. Five, no, does he? yeah. He's got a whole Jeeper group he rolls with. Deeper it gets, the more the needle moves up, so we're kind of cresting a steep section right here, guys. Once we get up there, we drop back down and I'll start throttling up to run eight. Spell on me, baby.
sitting here being useless. Oh, whoa, what was I doing? I still think I have it hooked up. Yeah. All right, let's start turning. You can stay off right there. Okay. Won't make it there. Won't be there. Won't crank or just won't fire. Won't crank. <laughs> now why is that a I don't want to have to start this thing again, that's for sure. Hey guys, is there a way that AI can dispatch? I like dispatching, but sometimes I just want to run the train. It would be nice if if uh, you didn't know what was coming, especially on the single track stuff. So, if there's a way for the AI to dispatch, let me know, please. That's a problem because that was a tire. I screwed it up. I, yay, yay. Okay, where did I link these to? Whoa. Helpers get three units. The third <laughs> unit would have done the job.
just grab another run because I'm tired of going this way. I'm over it. We're in the red. Oh, ho, ho, we didn't break. Holy moly. Most I've done up the Cone Pass was eight miles an hour. Wow! Okay, what's walking speed <laughs> for a human? Me and you could easily run eight miles an hour. So, however long you think it would take from, let's say, the 210 freeway there. Yeah. At the 15 junction to the top of the pass if you were to just run the whole thing next to the railroad that's how long it took <laughs> <laughs> it was awesome yeah they get paid by the hour <laughs> if I got some of that ogre time yeah Those again. Be right back. No. Okay, do these look decent or what? This looks kind of janky over here, maybe. Uh, not too bad. Okay, let's put this in here. Hey, we're still in one piece. How about that? So have you ever seen like a engineer conductor just like whizzing off a train that's going, oh no, you got the little toilets up front, huh? There was one guy that would piss off the front of the unit going uphill. <laughs> Into the wind. Yeah. He was pissing into the wind. Yeah. Did he eat crayons too? Some felt that he did. My goodness. One of the finest conductors ever on the railroad. Just kidding. Sarcasm. Apparently the uh, special ed forces of the Salvation Army. My dad did not like him very much. <laughs> oh my god. I can't imagine you. Oh. My. Dad, I can't believe your dad didn't, just didn't throw him off. Yeah. Good well, god. Company, company policy is why he did it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, not only is your dad gigantic, he is, uh, ooh. He's a badger. He's a wolverine, that one. <laughs> He's a wolverine. Hey, Brian, you out there? Oh, yeah, he, Ooh, he would man. shoot this guy out every day because he was so bad. <laughs> oh, wow. So he had to work with him for like a year. Oh, my God. Elevated blood pressure. <laughs> I can't believe your dad didn't have like a stroke with that guy. <laughs> or a heart attack. Yeah. Your dad. 
You know what I haven't done in a while is a save. It's a good idea. Yeah. Cause I got a lot done, dude. I got a lot done. I the yard's complete, and now I'm just laying the track on the inbound outbound or two big ass sidings, however you want to call it. <laughs> <laughs> Good this will man. actually complete my yeah. This will complete my loop, so I'm about to do some switching. Sweet. When I hook these up, so I'm just gonna do that. Do the main line later, and then the next time we do this, um, I really hey, if you guys are actually still watching this, uh, I would really like you guys' feedback on if this is too boring for you guys or what, whatever. But, yeah, it's, uh, it's kind of a test video. Yeah. Because this is awful long, so. Yeah. I don't know. My computer's going to have a fun time uploading this. Oh, my God. It's going to take days for you. Uh-huh. Well, probably going to need to do some hold fast. <laughs> so yeah. we have a couple <laughs> filler days. <laughs> uh, UP detector. UP detector. Ah, right on cue. There's a proper UP train right here. About 14, 15 up the hill. Nice. Proper. Is there a shit ton of smoke coming out of the stacks? Not yet, but they'll, they'll go. Oh. It's a matter of time. What do you got? If it's a proper UP train, you're gonna have like one on fire, about to catch fire. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I gotta stand up. <laughs> uh. <laughs> what the hell? Oh. I love people who can't park. That really made, puts a smile on my face. Uh. I see my neighbors not being able to park. <laughs> okay. Ooh wee. All right. So what do we got here? Got a bunch of trains coming against us up to Hatchapi. That's what we got here. What's well, going to be interesting about coming down this hill, which we'll have to make the next video, whether we play it today or not, <laughs> I'm gonna have, we're going to have to split this video in half again. Yeah, definitely. In fact, we might as well do that right now. Oh, uh, no, let me finish this siding. Right. And then because I will be moving the train after the siding. Anybody know how to get rid of this cross, this red cross? Please tell me. Thank you. You got a red cross? What? Yeah, it's like a plus sign. Oh, is it like in your screen or something? Yeah, it's kind of like Roads Online, how they got the little orange reticle. Like the little oh, plus sign. Yeah. But this one's really big. <laughs> it's annoying. Oh. See, what I do is, uh, here's a pro tip for you gamers. Okay, so if you go into GTA, like say you play GTA 5 or any of the shooters, that dot in the center of your screen where your aim point is, is usually the same. So GTA is a good one to do it with. I can't remember what the other game, Kingdom Come, if you have a little that little yellow dot, you can do this with. And then what I do is I put a clear piece of tape on the on my actual monitor in real life, and I put a little red sharpie mark on there. And that way, I know exactly what I'm looking at in all these games, where the where you're actually looking and grabbing and stuff. So I permanently have a red dot on my monitor. Uh. And then, so, it's kind of funny because when you watch video, uh, YouTube videos and stuff, oh, I screwed that up, um, 
you'll, you'll, you, like, when people are talking, you'll see this, like, red dot on their face. It's pretty funny. Uh -huh. But it really, if you want to pick up your shooting game, because in GTA, what happens, um, you will, you can line up your aim before when you go to shoot and then the dot appears, you can line up the shot before you take it. And it's like, it, you'll, your shooting will get better with that dot on your monitor. Nice. So, I don't know how many of you railroad guys play shoot 'em up games, so. Okay, I have that installed and it's decent. Let me save this. Alright. And then, so you just want to stop and then restart again? We'll keep recording, but okay. we'll in, I'll end this episode with the editing and all that. So, oh, okay. So Sweet. keep it going keep on your going. end, yeah. Don't, don't want to leave sessions. All right, guys. Well, this was a little bit of a, a test video. If you like the whole dual game thing, let us know. Um, if you don't, let us know. We just thought it would be something different to do and keep you guys entertained in the meantime so thanks for he, watching he's, yeah hold on <laughs> he's getting better internet and that's our problem right yeah now. yeah yeah when we're you just live in the woods when you live in the woods and you don't want to be around <laughs> people yeah <laughs> i'm jealous but i have internet <laughs> <laughs> so anyways you guys like subscribe comment share Join our Discord. It'll be in the description. Check out our Steam. We got free content for uh, Trains of New Era, the whole Trains series. So check us out on Facebook and like that. And uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think of this. Please help me with the controls on this game. I'm not good at <laughs> <laughs> I'm not the best when it comes to reading. So. <laughs> yeah. I can't blame you on that one. Kind of dumb. Okay. Yeah. Kind of retarded. <laughs> so, we'll see you next time. There'll be a part two of this kind of video. Part three of my total journey on run eight. Trying to get from Mojave to Bakersfield. So, here we go. <laughs> 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 we'll see you next time, guys. Bye.